Second grade is supposed to be a time to grow and learn, but the father of one Chicago boy believes his son's physical delays led to classroom punishment. Only on two, Dana Kozlov reports he's now taking his concerns to federal court. Like this or this? Eight-year-old Zakarian Townsend loves Legos. Now you ready to turn the page? His dad yeah. says it's a way to help him develop his fine motor skills, with which he still struggles. Buttons, zippers, you know, some of those type of things. Anthony Townsend believes Zakarian's second grade teacher at Horizon Science Academy in McKinley Park couldn't tolerate those struggles last school year, leading to treatment of the then second grader that prompted him to file a federal civil rights lawsuit today. I know last year wasn't so fun, huh? Can you tell me why? Because the teacher uh, she said I was being too talkative, so she put me in a corner. For how long? She's going to put me in there for three months. I couldn't believe it, um, that he been going through this all this time. This is that desk Zakarian was given by teacher Sarah Krippinger, wedged between a wall and cabinet. It made me feel alone and like... Pretty scared. Townsend says he didn't even know about it until he was called to discuss Zakarian's damage to school property, consisting of cabinet scratches and a torn book page. Then he found out his son was also forced to ask for basic classroom supplies available to other students, but not him. It horrified me. Zakarian even wrote notes to his teacher hoping things would change. I started to get thoughts and things that I needed to do to make me feel better. So like, I asked her if she could be a little bit more nicer, but I didn't want to walk up here up front, so I just put it on a piece of paper. Do you believe he was being discriminated against? I do. I do. Townsend says the teacher had expressed frustration he often delayed classmates here. struggling with zippers and it's such. Then he learned the gym teacher, Krippinger's boyfriend, allegedly did this. Grabbed him by the neck, which was a battery. Um, a criminal offense, dragged him out of the bathroom and into the hallway when his pants were halfway down in front of the other children. He was abused, he was isolated, he was uh, subjected to this abusive behavior because he has a disability. Repeated calls to Horizon Science Academy literally went unanswered today. I also left several messages with the charter school's parent, Concept Schools. None of those calls were returned. And I tried to reach out to the former teacher on social media. I did not hear back from her. Zakarian, by the way, is now in another school. Live in the control room, Dana Kozlov, CBS2 News. Brad. Dana, thank you.